get a common experience payment, CEP. All former students who lived at a residential school and who were alive in May 30th, 2005, are eligible for a CEP. If you're like me, you know what the government and church has done to our people. The residential school did not help maintain our family values, our self-esteem, our education, or our place in Canadian society. And now they want us to settle with their residential school agreement, their lawyers, and their courts. And we're just supposed to believe that this agreement is good for all of us? In the past, the government officials and churches said they're sending the people to residential school for their own good. I suggest you proceed with caution regarding the choices the government is offering you. If you're unsure, get your own lawyer. Do not readily agree with the options the government is providing. Take another look at this agreement, for it is confusing and offers you the same old take it or leave it scenario. I suggest you proceed with caution talk to a lawyer, because we have the opportunity to make better choices today on our own terms and not what they think is best for us. The Grits are my relations. Heichka. Hey, hey, hey.